have a look at that. Ever wondered what it's like to get bitten by a big crayfish? Look at that. Oh, my finger is throbbing like buggery. He only got me on the very tip. You can just sort of see two little puncture marks there. That was from the very tip of his claws. There he is down there. He's a nice cray. He's, uh, I've measured him. He's about 10 centimetres from his eye to his tail, which is the minimum legal size. But he's right on that minimum legal size. And I'm not really fully trusting my tape measure, so I'm going to throw him back. But if you look under here, you can see all blood under him. That's not from the crayfish, that's from my finger. And the scary thing is, he only just nipped me. And I'll show you the footage in a second, and I will warn you, I say a swear word. As I'm pretty sure most people probably would in this situation. Oh, two, and one of them's a big one. Yes, you ripper. And it's got no eggies. I think I think I've got myself a legal cray here. Well, that's small, obviously. That goes back. I'll get me trusty tape measure out that doesn't measure from zero to 130. Now. My friend Matt Furling gave me a proper tape measure last year or earlier this year when I caught up with him for measuring crays and I knew exactly where it was up until about two weeks ago when I just decided to clean that part Ow, you fucker! Ow, 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 ow! Look at that. <laughs> I've been nipped by a big cray. He only just got me with the end of his with the end of his claw. No eggs. Mate, I was gonna throw you back, but if you're legal, I'm gonna eat you now because that bloody hurt. As I was saying, Matt Thurling gave me a tape measure and I had it in a safe spot until about two weeks ago, then I moved it and now I don't know where it is. You can see the puncture marks there at the top. <laughs> you know, with all the stupid, dumb stuff that I do, I don't even think I've got any band-aids in my car. I'll find something to fix it up with and keep me crying. I'm not going to let that send me home early. No way. You can see here, there's a top and a bottom wound. He's only just got me with the very end of his pincers, and I pulled it out really quickly. I don't know what would happen if he'd got me with the whole claw. But first aid has arrived. Ow, 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 ow. Hi everyone, I'm Nurse Holly. Um, I helped my dad today because he got bitten by a crayfish. Just a reminder out there, don't get bitten by a crayfish or else you might get your finger amputated if it gets too hard. So just a reminder, don't get bitten by a crayfish. Thank you very much for your assistance, <laughs> Nurse Holly.